Welcome to Smoky CNC Woodworks. I'm Brian, and today, right off, I gotta tell you, sorry. I know I'm running behind. I'm probably nine or ten days out uh, from my last video. I actually had a game plan. We went and did a little craft show, or it was a peach festival in a town not from far from here. We put up a booth and sold some stuff, and I had this great big game plan. I was going to take my video camera walk around because there were several people that did some CNC stuff at it and I was just going to look at their stuff and maybe talk to some of the people that did it and uh, look at some of the other crafts. So I had to meet with my parents, they were coming in there and I had to give my mom some stuff and I had it all in an envelope. So she got it and went home and about an hour and a half later calls me and says, uh, did you mean to put a memory card in the envelope? No. I didn't. So, needless to say, there was no video shot. That's why I've got a gap here because I had this big game plan of putting it in there for Saturday or Sunday, but uh, didn't work. So anyway, today what we're going to do is a appreciation plaque for the National Park Service. Here at Sulphur we have the Chickasaw National Recreation Area, and when park rangers and many of the employees come in, they get appreciation plaques on the way out because the way they work, I mean, it's a really neat deal. I was talking to a park ranger the other day that spent like four years at Mount Rushmore. I mean, awesome. And so he went from there to another place and then bounced to here, been here for three or four years. And so they just can kind of bounce all over the United States as long as there's an opening at the national park they want to go to. And so I'm thinking some of the employees can do the same thing. I'm not 100% sure on that. I just know the rangers can. So today what we're doing is an appreciation plaque for somebody that's spent about four years here and they're heading on to some other place. And this one's going to be for them. So let's get started. <laughs>
So guys, came up pretty neat. Uh, I still yet have to put some polyurethane on it. I am going to put a couple of coats of poly on here, get it all nice and shiny, and put a hanger on the back. Uh, I'm still just letting this stain dry, and I know I'm going to get busted on some of this because you saw when I was clearing out these large areas, people are going to ask me why I didn't use a clear, uh, clear out tool path. It's where you get a bigger bit and it takes just a bunch of the open area out. I was going to, my fear was it was going to get too close to my letters and I'm just going to have to research that more to see exactly how to do that because I wanted the slanted edges on the letters so they'd be nice and raised like that. I mean you can see how they're raised up. I think it gave it a real cool look. And so what this is is the National Park Service patch that's on their shoulder and uh, just the information for the people that were here and going. I think it came out great. Uh, there's things I do. I'm probably going to do different if I do another one. I'm going to change up a little bit of the tool pathing stuff to make it a little more. Oh, how can we put it? Uh, efficient. Uh, definitely going to work on the painting because that painting on those letters with a paintbrush and those mountains. Oh man, man, it horrible. I don't know how else to put it. Horrible. <laughs> but so guys, that's going to be it for this one. If y'all haven't done so yet, please subscribe. I'll see you all next time.